Hi, and welcome to another in phase training video. In this quick video, you'll learn how to test the terminating resistor of communications between the IQ Gateway, IQ System Controller 3 or 3G, or IQ Battery 5P has failed. First, check to make sure that there's a terminating resistor connected to the control header at the starting and ending node. Sometimes the control header is also referred to as the green terminal block. If a resistor is missing, connect the resistors that were included in the IQ battery or IQ system controller's original packaging. If the correct resistor is properly connected to the control header, you should verify if it is operating normally. A faulty resistor will most likely affect the quality of communication passing through the control cable network. To test for this issue, remove the resistor from the terminal header and place the probes of your multimeter on both ends. Your multimeter should read between 114 and 126 ohms. If the resistance is outside of this range, it needs to be replaced with one of the other resistors provided in IQ battery or IQ system controller's original packaging. After you replace the resistor, make sure that communication between devices has improved. If the issue persists, contact in phase customer support. Thanks for watching another in phase training video. Now you know how to properly test the terminating resistor.